Hello everybody, how's it going? Today we're going to make one of my favorite, sort of like a stir fry, and I call it chicken yakalak. I know none of y'all have ever heard of chicken yakalak because it's a name that I made up. And I'll tell you about it later, but we're going to get this chicken going here. I got one more of these great big chicken breasts. Look what big chicken breasts these are. These came down from Harris Teeter, and they were on sale, and I got a big pack of them, so we're down to the last one. So it'll be the last chicken dish for a while. But anyhow, I got water boiling right here behind me in my wok, and what we're going to do is just cut this chicken up in little pieces. Just kind of cube it in little pieces. And then we're going to drop it in that boiling water and let this chicken cook. Just like this. And also at the same time, I got water over here boiling. Because this is going to have rice in it. So I got a thing from the food line. Whole grain brown rice. And they come in these little pouches. So you drop this pouch in boiling water. And it takes about 10 to 12 minutes. So I'm going to go ahead and drop this in. And set my timer for 12 minutes so that'll be cooking now I'm gonna cut all this chicken up I'm gonna drop it all in my wok I already got water can you see water's in my wok all the steam coming off all right then when I come back maybe I'll tell y'all then I'll get this chicken going and then I'll tell y'all while I why how this got its name all right, be right back with you. All right, we're rolling on here. I covered the pan with the chicken in it so the steam would help cook it a little bit faster. Now I'm gonna take this little gadget. It's from Pampered Chef. It's really to mash like um, hamburger when you're frying it. But I use it for this chicken too, to just kind of go like this in the pan. And if there's any chunks of chicken, it'll mash it down and like shred it up just a little bit so that way it, it'll cook faster and I won't get any big chunks in my food it'll be kind of mashed down now all the water is boiled out of this now so we're going to cut this off for a minute we got the rice corn over here it's boiling and you know when you cook pasta sometimes you get a lot of foam come up in your pan well, I stick a wooden spoon into my pot, and that keeps the foam down. All right, we'll be right back with you. All right, I'm going to kind of show you all the water now. It's gone out of here, and it's just strictly chicken. And I'm going to stir that on low just for a little bit. It's going to let that chicken uh, brown up a little bit while we're waiting on the rice to get done. So we just chop that around through there like that. Letting that brown up real good. I turn the fire off and let this brown up good. We got about another minute or two on the rice. I'll go ahead and tell you all the story now while I uh, wait on this, while I call it chicken yakalak. When I married my husband, he had some small children and when they would come over for the weekend, I'd make this. And the first time I made it, they wanted to know what it was called. And I told them it was Chicken Yakalak. And so I told them that. I'd make up names of food all the time. So that way, when they'd go back home and their mom might ask them what they ate or something, you know, or the kids would say, why don't we have Chicken Yakalak for dinner? Their mother would have no idea what I fed them. <laughs> Anyhow, I thought it was funny to make up food names. So this is how it got its name, and I call it Chicken Yakalak to this day, and all of us love it. All right, y'all. It's been 12 minutes on this rice, so I'm going to pull this rice out of the hot water here. Let it drain. It's just a bag of brown rice. You can use any kind of rice. This is what I happen to have. All right. Drain it right there for a minute. Let's sit there in that bowl. I'm going to cut 
cut it open and throw it into my wok here with my chicken. All right. So just dump that right into your wok with your chicken. All right. And to that, I'm going to add some peanuts. Because my favorite Chinese dish is chicken and peanuts. I don't want any vegetables. I don't want any fillers. I say no veggie tables, no fillers when I go there. Chicken only, peanuts only. So these are some peanuts from Costco. And this is about how many I got left in the can. So I'm going to use all these up here. Just going to dump them right into the chicken and rice and peanuts. And then I have some of this. This is just a random stir fry from the grocery store. I'm going to put this in there. I'm going to turn my wok back on. Y'all can see I'm just going to drizzle this over there. No rhyme or reason how much you put on there. If it's a little dry, I can always add. Well, I'm about out of wok stuff here, so I'll get a little bit more here. All right, this is just a little bit left in this bottle, so I ran some hot water in it, and I'm just going to shake it off and get all the goodness out of that bottle, and I'm just going to pour this into there. That way I'll make it right juicy. Get me a spoon over here, and then I'm going to let you kind of see it if I can on the fire here. I'm just going to mix this up like this. And basically, I just cook it a little bit like this. It's all, the chicken's done, the rice is done. I'm just going to saute it a little bit in that stir-fried juice. And it's going to be ready to eat. Now, if y'all want to add onions, if you want to add celery, water chestnuts, any kind of filler that uh, you can add, some broccoli. I didn't have any of that today. And, of course, my favorite is just chicken and peanuts. So here we go. I'll scoop a little bit of this out so you can see it in the dish here. I'm just going to put this on simmer and cover it up. Just going to let that simmer for a couple minutes while I get over here with y'all. All right, and I'm going to do the taste test here. Can you kind of see it there? It's just chicken and peanuts and some stir-fry sauce. Might be too hot to eat. I don't know. Mmm. The peanuts are crunchy. Just how I like it. Mmm. Yep. I'm going to cook this a little bit longer. And let that uh, sauce a little bit caramelize. Mmm. Chicken yakalak. Mm. Y'all try this and let me know what you think. And you can use any type of stir fry sauce or whatever you like. Talk to y'all later.